we are. We've got Miss Ashley helping me record, as always, and thank you so much for doing so. Thank you for everybody who came out tonight. What we taught, a move called the Check Whip. Done this a few years ago, brought it back to Nick's for the first time in 2016. This move has elements of a couple of things that Ashley and I have actually talked before and done before. And five, and we we'll call it and six. I'll put those links in the upper right corner as the video rolls so you can see how they're similar, but they are different. So we're gonna sugar and then we're gonna show you how to do it. Sugar, one, two, three, and four. Call the check whip. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, and eight. Triple, and then she anchors. Yeah, it's very cool. One of my favorite ones that I've done. Long time dancing. Starts out as your basic whip to four. So once we sugar, she turns on the first two sets, jump off the track, and then she coasters. Guys, you get on the track and in the way. Okay, so we're just going to go this way. We're going to go to four. We're going to go one, two, three, and four. That's all that is. All right. Now the next part is really essentially where the check takes place. You need a good connection. You have to have a good lead for this to work. So we're going to sugar again. One, two, three, and four. We're going to go to four. One, two, three, and four. Frame is important here, guys, because really, you're going to make her turn on five, five. You're going to put her weight on her left foot, and guys, you're going to step off to the right. But you do not want to make her step any further. So this means your right hand, which is underneath her left, is the key. Because what you want to do is pull her on five and step her back onto her right foot on six. So it's called a check step. So we're just going to go this way just to see it. One, two, three, and four. You make her turn on five. Use both hands to put her back on her right foot on six. Guys, you're taking two steps like normal. So shoulder push, one, two, four, we're gonna go to six. Five, and six, we're gonna go one, two, three, and four, five, six. And what I'm doing is I'm lowering my arm, my shoulder, my right arm, which makes her turn, but then I actually push her back onto her right foot. So we'll do this way. One, two, three, and four, five, six. And really the key to this is right underneath her left arm. That's where I really got a good hold of her and I'm putting her back onto that step. Let's do it this way just so you can see that step. One, two, three, and four, right five, six. Then from there, from six, she's gonna coast her for seven and eight. Gentlemen, you're gonna back on the track. Seven and eight. This is actually a prep for her to her right. And that will end up making a turn. So we're gonna go this way. One, two, three, and four, five, six, triple step. Prepping her to her right, jumping off the track, then she just does a triple turn and half left, triple step, and triple step. Okay, you gotta move off the track on that first triple or you'll be in her way. Three and four, five and six. So one, two, three, and four. Check, step, send her through, send her. Just now. One more time, this direction, we're finished. Sure, push. One, two, three, four, five and six. One, two, three, and four. Check, out of the way, send her. Done. Perfect as always. Thank you. Thanks for watching, everyone, as always. Thanks for coming if you did. We'll see you next Thursday night. Have a great week. Keep dancing.